I'm really excited about this lesson today. I'm really excited about this lesson today. Uh, we're going to do some Slayer-inspired riffs. This is a backhand jug song called "Can You Feel the Love Inside Me." <laughs> I think it was about probably half four when I went to bed. <laughs> the first riff uh, was inspired by kind of, uh, it's like an angel of death sort of vibe. Right? Like, uh, angel of death, uh, how does that work? Da -da 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 -da. Oh, I know what that is. What is it? Of like inverted that riff, you know, so it's it's almost the same, but I've kind of inverted it. So it's uh, it's now backhand jaggerfied. And, uh, we're, we're touching the metal with this. We're touching the metal. Could you show us that riff at half speed for the readers of <laughs> yeah. Total Guitar? For the readers of Total Guitar, here's that riff at half speed. <laughs> For the readers of Total Guitar, could you play that riff at quarter speed, please? <laughs> I don't know if I can. Is that like slightly faster? <laughs> okay. I don't even know if I can do that. The difference a hard pick makes makes all the difference. Get those pinched harmonics. That one, because I can't get the harmonics. Next riff uh, is the main sort of chuggy part, uh, which is the verse. No, that's not the verse, but it's just this, it's the chorus part actually. So it reprises in the chorus, uh, and this riff goes like this, like so. <laughs> Another Slayer song, uh, Angel of Death. Is it Angel of Death or the uh, famous uh, Rainy Blood bit? I can't remember which Slayer song it is now, but it's, there's a Slayer song that might be Angel of Death somewhere. Rainy Blood. Maybe Rainy Blood. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. It's one of those ones. Anyway, so the next part is the really fast double speed stuff. Then leads us into an outro guitar solo, <clears throat> where which is something vaguely like this. about more.
modern guitar. Right. Oh. Go. Things to consider about modern guitar is uh, the feel. What you really need to do, you need to feel the metal. You need to not only feel the metal, but you need to taste the metal. You need to taste the metal, you need to feel the metal, you need to sniff the metal, you need to dry hump the metal, you need to make the metal yours, uh, as you would a, a, um, a, a small animal. You need to make it yours and add your own twist to it. Um, you know, so many kids these days that I see, uh, all, all, all they're into is, is arpeggios and scale runs, and it's all, it's all well and good, but, you know... Give me a one-note guitar solo any day. Uh, thanks for listening, and uh, I'll see you next week for more... Metal! <laughs> Join us next week for a country picking special. Uh, thanks, my name's Dave, and I'll see you next time on guitarlicks.com.